Hey, what's up you guys? If you're gonna be towing a trailer with your Nissan Frontier, you gotta get trailer wiring put on your vehicle. It's, it's required by the law. You will need the tool seen here to complete this installation. Right out of the package, you're gonna see that you have two connectors. One plug and play here that goes into the back of the vehicle. And another plug and play connector here that goes into the passenger side kick panel. Um, you're gonna also notice that you have three relays. And we'll go ahead and put those into the connector now. Brown is gonna go to the brown connector. Plug it in until it clips. And then you have two white connectors. That's where the blue relays will go. Okay, I'll go ahead and set this guy aside for a minute and let's get the rear connector plugged in. So right behind the bumper on the driver's side frame, you have two wiring connectors here. We'll be using the gray one. Um, to give more room, I'm gonna just pull down on it out of its position and slide it out, just like that. And it gives us a little bit more room to work with here. So to take the cap off, we're gonna press this button in here and then just pull straight out, just like that. And we're gonna take our provided connector by the wiring manufacturer and just plug it right into its position here. Okay, and that's it for the back of the vehicle. Now we'll go ahead and install the connector to the front uh, passenger side kick panel. Okay, so we're on the passenger side of the vehicle here. Um, to remove this kick panel, we need to get the driver or the passenger side step up, and it's real simple. You just wedge your fingers in here and pull straight up, and it unclips out, just like that. I'll go ahead and set that aside. This is the kick panel where the wiring connector is behind, so we just need to pull this out. To do that, there is a clip down at the firewall. It just unscrews and pulls right out. And then two body plugs, one here and one here. And it just simply just pulls out. Okay, again, we're just gonna take this connector off, set that aside, and now it's just pulling away from the body. that. Now we're going to expose the connector here. I'll take the wiring connector, just plug it right in. Okay. Now all we have to do is tuck this back up put our kick panel back in and our passenger side step in and we're wired up for towing a trailer. Okay, and we can put the step back in and Okay, so we're back at the vehicle. You can see that uh, this is our four flat connector here and it's folded up. I'm going to unfold it here and show that uh, it gave us quite a bit of wire here to reach out to a trailer or mount wherever you want on the bumper. Um, our hitch here has a wiring bracket. Um, it's really a good idea to spend a couple extra dollars to get a wiring 
bracket, a four flat convective bracket here to mount to our wiring bracket on the hitch. It makes it look really nice, clean and professional. So we're gonna go ahead and do that for you here. Take a 3 8 wrench and tighten it up. Okay, perfect. Now we need to do is just take our four flat, route it underneath the bumper here and over the hitch. We'll just kind of slide it through the bracket here. Four flat has two little notches on it that'll clip right over these two notches on the four flat bracket. And that'll hold it into place there. Okay, now that it's into place, we can go ahead and take our dust cover, put it over. And then our last step is to take this excess wire. We're gonna go ahead and take a zip tie and just tie it up to an existing harness up here so that it's out of the way and it looks really nice, clean and professional. And that's it for our trailer wiring on the Nissan Frontier. Have fun and be safe. Thanks for watching. To learn more about the product seen in this video or to schedule an installation by U-Haul Hitch Professional, visit us online today at uhaulhitches.com.